About three days ago, my brother said to me, have you seen the rabbit? That's been like everywhere. Like, have you seen the rabbit? And I'm like, no. Like, which rabbit, right? So, we have wild rabbits less than like, less than like half a mile from my house. There's like a lot of wild rabbits. But those wild rabbits are like brown. They're like brown with like white paws and they're kind of like moldy, speckled brown. Um, and there's a lot of them. Like, there's a lot of wild rabbits. It's not like, you know, like this fucking big deal when you see a wild rabbit. Um, but they normally don't come this close to where I live. Uh, like, there's normally a lot of wild rabbits. Pretty much half of a mile to like a mile away. Emily, welcome! I'm telling the story time. This is awesome, right? This is awesome. You, you'll love this. You'll love this. So, my brother's been telling me about this rabbit. And I'm like, right, so there's a rabbit. And he's like, yeah. So... We're kind of like talking about it pretty much like every day for the last three days. And today was the first day that he didn't mention seeing the rabbit. Like he said, I didn't see the rabbit today. Okay. So he's out of um, like town. I don't know, out of the village, whatever. He's not in this place. He's somewhere else. Uh, I live next door to him. He lives in the house next door. So our gardens are connected. So. This was the first time I'd seen the rabbit, and I put on Snapchat, I don't own a rabbit, and Turtle and Molly sent back, you do now, and I was like, debating whether to catch it. So I was like, should I try and catch it? It's somebody's pet. So I'm like, holy shit, right? Because, like, I should try and catch the rabbit, right? So I had a towel, right? I had like a big bath towel, like a big bloom, where the fuck is it? I don't have it to hand. It's a big blue and white bath towel. And my idea was to throw the towel on the rabbit, hope the rabbit got confused, and then pick up the bundle. And then maybe bring the bundle in the house until I could find out whose it was. And we have like a washing basket that like we put like our wet clothes in before we like go and hang them up. Like we have like a big washing basket. So I was thinking like I might throw the washing basket over it, right? Um, so we knew this wasn't a wild rabbit, was why I was like telling you about like the wild rabbits like it's a black rabbit it has fat ears like this and not like the big long ears um like it's really fat stubby ears you can tell it's like an actual pet rabbit right so i decided to go and get a fishing net <laughs> because we have a lot of fishing nets we we um we probably have like eight or nine fishing nets so this is like the short handled kind of like pretty wide fishing net but it's not very deep it's only really like this deep well not that like it maybe like double that but it's, it's like, it's not very deep to like actually have a rabbit in, right? So, I go out the back garden with this fucking net, and one of my neighbors is looking at me funny, and I'm like, fuck, like, and I'm getting embarrassed, right? And I decide I'm gonna like chase this rabbit, and I'm gonna like try and catch the rabbit. <laughs> at which point, um, well, behind my house, like, if I go back to like this picture, like, do you see this big area back here? like behind this fence this area is fucking huge like that extends up quite a long way um like quite a quite a long distance and there was um there were some boys walking a dog and i was like fuck and i was getting embarrassed right and i was like shit i look like an idiot so then they asked do you want help catching the rabbit rabbit patrol we fucking bring in the fuck <laughs> we get the whole fucking squad involved like, I give them a fucking net, and they start, like, chasing it, and one of my neighbors is building an extension on the back of his house, so he's, like, got these, like, you see the chain link fence and, like, the, the porta pot potty, porta loo, whatever, like, shit cabin, like, the outhouse thing, I don't know what the fuck you call it, a, we call it a porta loo, a porta loo, right, it's a porta loo, so there's, like, a chemi chemical toilet, chemical toilet, there's a chemical toilet there, um, and they were, like, <laughs> climbing on top of everything and like it says like no children like don't play here blah 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 because it's a fucking building site um because that's like the, you can see the extension here like that's the extension part over there on that side so anyway uh it gets stuck under this car and like they they can't fucking like get it out and then it comes under my brother's car and i'm like this is perfect so i get like this really long uh we call it a stretcher um a stretcher is like a, it's about an eight and a half foot, nine foot uh, piece of wood. And what you do is you prop up your clothesline 
uh, to keep like towels and stuff off the ground, or if you're like, I don't know, like that's what it's for, or it's to lift it up so you could walk under the washing and whatever. So like I get the stretcher and I slide it under the car and start moving it back towards the rear end of the car and it's hitting the bunny's butt the whole time. Working now? I didn't mute myself, it broke. Fucking hell. So anyway, I get like the, the clothes pole, I slide it under the back of the car, and uh, it starts running up the left side of this little like summer house thing, right? So, I like say like, throw me the net, right? And it like throws me the net, because we had two nets, but like, I didn't have my net, because I was like, filming and had a stretcher. So, um, he like, chases the rabbit up the left hand side, and it's basically sitting about where it is there. And I like throw the net over it and like slide the net under its legs and pick it up. And oh shit! Hey! <laughs> so I caught the fucking bunny rabbit. <laughs> no, this is the part of the story I didn't tell you. The boys who were walking their dog and the fucking rabbit patrol, like these guys, right? I asked them. I was like, dude, like uh. Like, are the people who own the rabbit in their house? Because if they're in their house, they can come and get the rabbit. Like, they're free to come up our back garden, they could come on our property. Like, whatever, they can come on our property, right? Like, I'm allowing them. That was the whole point of saying that, right? They said they weren't in. So I'm thinking, what the fuck do I do with this rabbit? So I'm thinking I could put it in a bin? Or I could put it in, like, a upside-down, um like washing basket, like the clothes basket, and like I, I could put it in my room, we could have had it on the stream in my room, I have like a cardboard box, or like I could have done something, right? Um, so it turns out that they were in all along, and they could have been helping this entire fucking time. And the woman has four kids, and they're all like under five, they're like four little uh, blonde girls, I think, I think one of them's like, I think one set of the girls are twins, and the other two are just sisters. I don't know. There's, like, a lot of little blonde kids, right? So they're, like, absolutely, like, ecstatic that we've got back this, uh... What's it called? The, the, we've got back the bunny rabbit. That's what it's called. So they're ecstatic that, like, we've got back this bunny rabbit. And, uh... The other boys are, like, kind of, <laughs> like, super hype at that point. <laughs> and I'm, like, pissing myself laughing. I actually took a picture. Oh, shit. I actually took a picture of the hutch. I actually took a picture of it. Let me get, try and get the picture of the hot chop. Um, hmm. How can I get a picture of the hutch? I took a picture. Because I wanted to, like, show the bunny back in its little house. But, um... It didn't, it didn't want to be in its little house. It didn't want to, like, show its little face. Uh... What if I do this? Oh, this. There you go. So there's the hutch. <laughs> I couldn't get a picture of it in his little house, but I wanted a picture. But this is how it's got out. Look. This is how it got out. There's like only a little latch on the door, like a little black latch, and then there's a white latch, and then there's a couple of pieces of wood. But the, the back garden has a huge wall. Like, there's no gaps in the wall. It had to have come out of the gate in the uh, back garden, but that hutch isn't very secure. Like, that hutch is really not secure at all. Like, like that's not secure. So, I don't know. I think that's the end of the story, basically. But, like, we could really, like, I could probably go back there with, like, a drill. And, like, a padlock and a latch. I mean, it would cost, like, what, like, fucking three pound? For, like, a padlock and a little latch set. A couple of screws. I'm tempted. I'm tempted to make sure I don't need to fucking go catch this rabbit again. So, yep, yeah, there you go. That's the, um... That's the rabbit. <laughs>